Check, 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 check. Check. What is going on, YouTube? So we're back in the home studio. Uh, about to do a really cool project for you guys. It's no secret. I like to do a lot of projects involving lighters of the disposable kind. There goes that one. After a while, these ordinary lighters kind of get boring. So today, we're going to hack this, make it more modern by doing what I've done to many things before, and that is cramming a laser inside of a cheap disposable lighter. Now, I've done this with a Zippo lighter in the past. Um, that was really small. That was kind of a challenge to fit all the components inside of uh, that tiny shell. I don't know. I think this is a little bit bigger, um, so hopefully it should be a little bit easier. Actually, what am I saying, guys? I already made it. It's right here. I'm filming this intro at the end of the video. Check this out, guys. Just kidding. You got to watch the video. So yeah, this project's pretty simple to make. I'll leave links to lasers down in the description. I don't think they're not, they're not very expensive at all. I probably paid like $15 for this. Now shipping does take a while. Probably buy a more expensive one and the shipping won't be that bad. Uh, but yeah, the plan is to uh, rip apart a laser and uh, stick it inside a lighter. I think Kip K did a video very similar to this back in the day. The OG uh, DIY people know what I'm talking about. I want to try it for myself and plus I'm going to add a rechargeable battery to it so it's not a disposable thing. Um, we can actually recharge and reuse it. So that's the plan. Let's do it. little update guys I've emptied the fuel out of these two lighters one of which is the Bic and the other one is like the off-brand I'm not really sure which one's going to be the best housing we're gonna hollow these out and uh, figure out how to cram this 100 milliwatt laser into these lighters let's do it so I was able to remove the laser diode from uh, this laser right here. Well, this is actually a different one. This is uh, what's left of the uh, original laser. But yeah, we got out the laser diode. One other thing I did was to tape on the focusing piece right here, because uh, without it, the beam's just super dispersed and it's like a flashlight, and it's not gonna be able to burn anything. Um, I actually accidentally disconnected one of the leads, so I had to re -solder that, so that's why it looks a little bit messed up, but it still works. And now we have to figure out a way to cram it inside of uh, this lighter right here. What do you think? Think, think it'll fit? We'll make it work. The original battery it came with was uh, this Ultrafire. These are like, these are pretty much the standard, like cheap Chinese batteries. Uh, I think it's what, like 3.7 volts, 0.2 amp hour battery. A little bit too big to fit inside the lighter. So I'm gonna probably step it down, maybe use a couple of button cells or potentially a few of these. I think this is a 12 volt battery. I'm assuming it's a lot lower amps. So I might have to use a couple of these, try and see how many of these we can fit inside of this lighter. Uh, that should be enough to power this laser right here. So I'm actually gonna try using this uh, 3.7 volts lithium ion battery instead because I think it's the perfect size to fit right in the bottom part of the lighter. Plus I think it put out more amps than the uh, original battery I was thinking of using.
All right guys, so here is our finished modified laser lighter. As you can see, we've got the laser diode packed down in there. Uh, and in the bottom, we've got the uh, 3.7 volt lithium ion battery along with uh, actually two prongs, which is what we're gonna use to charge this battery. Um, I made a little charging circuit as well. Um, so one of them positive, one of them negative, and we just plug that in there, and that will charge the battery. Um, so up here we have the push button switch to activate the laser. If I shine at the camera, it won't really do anything because it's at a far enough distance where the light's just so dispersed. Like I can shine it on my hand from this distance away. As you can see, it's just like, just literally like a circle. But if we bring it in closer, uh, about like, I think one inch away, I'll just show you on some electrical tape. Um, the beam goes from this like wide circle, focuses down, and then it'll start burning right about there. Um, which is exactly what we want. Like we don't want this to be like dangerous from a distance. Like if you accidentally are like, if you're lighting something in your hand and um, it hits you in the eye, like don't want it to be super focused and burn from a distance. Um, so that's good that it actually like unfocuses. Like it's literally just like a flashlight from this distance. Like it's really not gonna hurt you very much at all if it hits you. Um, but that being said, you don't wanna get super close and uh, get hit by this because obviously it will burn you there. So yeah, pretty simple build actually. All I had to do was rip apart a laser. I'll leave some links to uh, lasers down in the description below. Standard Bic lighter. You don't really wanna use the cheap ones for these builds. I usually use a lot of cheap ones, uh, but for this build, we kinda of want the higher quality ones uh, because they're a little bit bigger, more sturdy, and are probably not gonna crack the plastic as much. So yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. Uh, Laser module, laser diode in here, battery, charger. Oh yeah, one other thing you can do is screw this uh, focusing thing in and out more. You can adjust the um, burn distance. So right now, obviously, as I said, I have it like really close. So it works just like a normal lighter. Like you hold it up really close to the thing and it, uh, it'll it burn just like that. Uh, this is so cool, guys. Like I love like, I love modding like simple things like a lighter and turning them to really high tech gadgets like this. Uh, very cool, right up my alley. You can see, doesn't doesn't really harm the camera at all. That's uh, pretty much how this works, so what do you say we go test this on some stuff, see what it can do. Go. guys i'm gonna selfie this outro all right guys thank you very much for watching that is the video made a really cool little tiny uh, laser lighter right here pretty simple build probably took me a couple hours to figure this out um leave a like if you did enjoy this video and of course hit that subscribe button if you're not already and uh oh yeah comment your ideas below of uh cool stuff you want to see me make next i'll read some out from uh, my previous video uh, first up i have any comments make a stereotypes with your twin um yeah, I, I, I could probably see if Drake's down for that. Nice. Nice. See what I can do. And then uh, the video I did before that, anonymous guy comments, nothing gets you in the Christmas spirit like watching a kid named Jake Laser massacre a snowman with a bullet of ice. Very true. Merry Christmas. Oh. Damn. Anyway guys, comment down below what you want me to hear. I don't know, some funny jokes. Love reading them. Um, that's pretty much all I've got for this video, guys. Happy holidays, and we will catch you in the next one. Peace.